Several families in Egypt are mourning the deaths of loved ones who died in Libya after Storm Daniel hit the North African country. Egypt has a large population of nationals living and working in the country. CGTS Nick Madimba has more. Hassan Abdel Salehin is in pain, mourning the loss of four family members who were taken away so tragically by Storm Daniel in Libya. At his home in Bani Surf in Egypt, about 100 kilometers south of Cairo, family members and friends have arrived to console him. I have lost four members of my family, Ali Hassan Abdel Salehin, Ali Nadi Ali Benaswi, Sheita Gamal Abdel Wahad Benaswi, and Rukma Gamal Benaswi, all four of them. Hassan's family are right alone in the grieving. For more than 70 people in this same city on the River Nile also perished in the tragedy. From our town, there's more than 2,000 people in Libya. Most of the people in our town are working in Derna. Even youths as young as 15 or 20 years old go to work there. The number of people lost from our town, some families lost three, two or even one. It's like a whole nation. Losses are more than if there was a war. And in a case of tragic irony, her son had been soon expecting a son to arrive in Egypt, but not the way it happened. My son called his brother last Thursday for the last time, telling him that he will get clothes for the children and come to visit us in Egypt. He got himself clothes and came, oh my dear son. <laughs> Libya hosts a considerable number of the Egyptian diaspora who usually cross the land border into its east where most of the storm hit areas are located. The Egyptian Ministry of Immigration says they have so far recovered 87 bodies of Egyptians from the carnage. Nick Modimba, CGTN.